Hi guys, it's the Basic Gamer, and I hope you guys are doing well and having a fabulous time and enjoying the DLC as I am too. Well, quite a lot. What are we doing here today? We are here to check out how to get our hands on a talisman. Which one is it? It is the Fine Crucible Talisman. And what does it do? It increases your back steps. So it gives you some extra iframes, makes you faster, something like that. So, um, but it does increase the damage taken by 15% as well. So I haven't used this and well, I'm not like into this, but people who do use it, they do take quite a lot of benefit out of it, especially in PVP um, against their foes. So we're gonna be checking out how to get our hands on this talisman, which is the Fine Crucible Feather Talisman. Like I said, improves back steps, but increases damage taken by 15%. And where and how will you get it? We'll be showing you how to do that. So you gotta come, basically you gotta get it over here. It's like underground though, ancient ruins of ra Ooh which was the top bit, which you have to come from the Shadow Keep, okay? And how do you get to the Shadow Keep? Well, I'll just quickly show you on the map. There is a detailed video showing you how to get to the Shadow Keep, and I'll share the link to that video in the description below. But in this one, we'll just show you on the map. So you start off from here. That, that is, you start off the DLC from here. Touch the Graveside Plains Side Graves, pick up the map fragment from around about this area, come through the Scorched Ruins, Three path cross, watch out for the blister guy on the bridge, and then you touch the castle front. Side of Grace, so there are two ways. You either come through the castle, Lancis, and Fire Rolana, and then you come like this, or you can take, well, you can skip Rolana. So once you come to the castle front, you just gotta come through in this valley way, or gorge, whatever you wanna call it, um, and then come through like this and there's going to be a spirit spring somewhere around this area it's going to be sealed that's so got to come up around about this area there's going to be a pile of rocks over here the pile of rocks is going to be uh, in, the, in the middle of um, well, a circle of stones just smash it with your weapon and it'll bounce you up to this second point another jump spring will bring you to the behind the fort of reprimand side of grace come through the fort touch the more type side of grace steer clear from all the enemies and touch the Morth Ruins, Side of Grace. Map fragment of this area is gonna be around right over here. Now you can come and touch the High Road Cross, Side of Grace, or you can just go straight and just steer clear from these enemies. Big Furnace Golem over here as well. So if you come from the left side like this, and then you come to the Shadow Keep main gate, which, well, you take a lift up and you come here. You fight the Golden Hippopotamus in the main gate, Plaza Side of Grace. There's a video on how to take on the Hippopotamus as well, and you'll find the link to that video in the description below. Once you beat him, you'll have the main gate, Plaza Side of Grace, and just make your way out from here, up from the stairs, and come through this room like this. When you come out of the room, then watch out for these little guys, the, um, what is it, vulgar militia guys hiding behind the boats. And then there's gonna be a fire knight over here. So I just came like this, ran past them, took the lift up. And once you take the lift up, you will be at the storehouse first floor side of grace. The lift is right behind us. And what we're doing is we're gonna go this way, right? Uh, not to this point, but we take the lift down from here and you come straight through like this. And well, the rest I'll show you on the map because I can't show you that clearly, but where are we? Once again, I'll show you. We are at the storehouse first floor side of grace. That's the lift we took up. And now we take a left and just keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, the lift is not here. Well, the first time you come here, the lift is gonna be here. It's gonna be waiting for you. I just went down and then didn't send it back up. So, yeah, back steps, not back stabs, but it's got to do something with, like if you are good at doing the back steps and the iframes improve for you, apparently people who are good at taking back stabs are doing pretty well in PVP. So you can check it out and see how you go. Okay, so once you come here, if you go straight, you pick up a weapon, or not a weapon, just some item over there. I'm not sure what it is. Watch out for this guy, he's gonna always try to come out. But we took a right from when we came from the lift, and then we go down. Okay, just keep going. Watch out for all these guys. They're gonna try and jump you, 
and the stomp ya. Yeah. We're going this way. Yeah, no, not today. What does... What does that person say to death? Not today. Yeah. Okay, keep coming. So this is the west rampart side of Grace. Right? Let just sit here and show you. Yeah, this is the one. So this is where we've made it. Now keep coming through. You gotta come and open the door from the side. And once you come here, you can actually sit on torrent and make your way through straight in, okay? You come here, right? And just dodge the bats. There's a lot of stuff to pick up over here. There's gonna be a fire night. They're gonna be raining, rain of fire at you. So just keep going. Take the fire night out. I've already done it. Once you take the fire night out, you'll actually get an incantation from that fire night, which is rain of fire. So you get an incantation here. And that fire night is gonna be standing right here where this door is, okay? So you make your way through. Take a right and go up the stairs. And there's gonna be another lift that's gonna take you up, up, up. And we have not sent this back either. But yeah, this lift will be waiting for you the first time when you come around over here. It's gonna be right here, okay? So, not to worry. And then, we're, well, we're almost, almost there. So just hang in there. Once we come up out in the ancient ruins of Ra, uh, Ra'u, how do you pronounce it? I gotta check the pronunciations. Okay, so this one. All right, so once you come out of the door, hop on torrent, right, and then back. Through the woods, woodlands, steer clear, no fight in the bears. We be entering their habitat, so if they attack us, they're not on the wrong, and they're good guys, you know. So I don't fight these guys unless I have to, and they attack me and I gotta save my life. Otherwise, the steer clear. Whoa, oh. Okay, so you're gonna pick up a cookbook and another item over here, and then you gotta smash this door with your weapon because it's gonna be sealed the first time you come here. And then just take a right. And like I said, we are almost there, okay? You can check out this area for other stuff as well. I'm just taking you to our spot. So this door is gonna be closed, so you gotta open it. First time you come around, take a, and then take a right. There's gonna be a jump spring waiting for us. Take it down, okay? Once you fall down, just go straight and right and see where the marker is. Yep, that's the marker on the map. And you should find your item lying over here, okay? On that tree. You'll see it once you come here. See that? This guy is gonna try and get you on this body. You're gonna find the fine crucible feather talisman and well then you can check out what it does um and there's a way over there as well i haven't checked that out i'm just gonna get out of these guys get them out so that we can just be a bit more relaxed and show you one more time what we're talking about it is this one the fine crucible talisman so this is it for this one guys do check the description for other video links which will help you otherwise till next time happy gaming take care and bye bye